I have been getting a lot of requests to roast Bill Maher for his take on Dogecoin, calling it money boo boo. He also called out all cryptocurrency. So this was not just about Dogecoin, it was about all cryptocurrency altogether. Clearly, it's pretty obvious Bill doesn't know what he's talking about and neither do his writers. One of the first things he said, no product, no workers, just Easter Bunny cartoon cash in reference to Dogecoin. Really, he wasn't just saying that about Dogecoin, he was saying that about all cryptocurrency together. No workers, no product. Well, the first thing about Dogecoin is that because it's a cryptocurrency, it doesn't need to have a specific product. Its product is its usability. Its product is your ability to go to the store and buy something with it. Its product is it being a hedge against inflation. Its product is the community behind it. That's not a physical product, but it is a product. It is something that's valuable that Dogecoin can provide. No workers. That's one of the biggest advantages of Dogecoin and other cryptocurrencies. Yes, technically there's the development team behind it, but the development team for most cryptocurrencies is not getting paid directly. The development team is getting paid through donations or something along those lines, and that's where the development team actually works because with the banks you have to pay all the individual people to help make the system run and that makes it way more expensive way less efficient so bill he didn't even know he's actually making a positive case for dogecoin with that specific argument then he says it's just easter bunny cartoon cash now bill Everyone loves the Easter Bunny, so I don't know what your angle is here, and I can confirm as well the Easter Bunny is real, because when I was three years old, the Easter Bunny handed me an egg with candy in it. It had real candy in it, I ate the candy, I saw the Easter Bunny, and so Bill, I don't know what you have to say about that. The Easter Bunny clearly is not a good argument there against cryptocurrency. He said he does not understand it, and neither does anyone else. Now Bill, if you're referring to the 30 person team it takes you to write seven jokes on your show, if you're referring to that team when you say people don't understand cryptocurrency, and I have to agree with you there but for the most part people watching shows like this people watching and actually learning about crypto we do understand it we do understand why it works and why it's valuable so just because you don't doesn't mean that other people don't and i would say if you don't understand it then why are you talking about it and why are you trying to tell other people about it then we also see he pronounced it satoshi nakamoto instead of satoshi nakamoto then it gets worse he cited warren buffett who as everyone knows is not exactly a cryptocurrency enthusiast warren buffett is not a fan of cryptocurrency but Bill Maher citing Warren Buffett is like a Tyrannosaurus Rex citing a pterodactyl. If I want to go back in time, I will go and buy DeLorean, then I will call up Doc. Doc, by the way, who happens to be approximately half of Bill Maher's age. <laughs> back to the Future, it's a good movie. If you have not seen it yet, then who the heck are you and what planet are you from? Because everyone should have watched Back to the Future by now. One of the best movies of all time by far. It's not even particularly close. Then Bill Maher also, in his entire rant, in his monologue, he cited that he believes Bitcoin especially, but cryptocurrency altogether is worse for the environment than the current systems we have. And that's just simply not true. The systems we have are actually significantly more of an impact when it comes to the amount of emissions compared to cryptocurrency and Dogecoin. So that's a point that a lot of people are going to continue to try to push, especially through the eyes of the banks who benefit from cryptocurrency not succeeding because they're making a lot of money right now off of the current systems. So they do not want it to change and they're going to try to tell people things that aren't true. So be on the lookout for that. Also be on the lookout for people in the comment section pretending to be me. Make sure to go down there and press like if you are one of the people who presses like the more people we get doing that the more awesome things we're going to see happening in terms of making the dogecoin community bigger and making the cryptocurrency community bigger as a whole two very positive things that bill Moore doesn't want to see happen but we do want to see happen because we understand the potential make sure you're also subscribing with notifications on those notifications especially for this channel are an extremely helpful and important tool i'm matt Wallace. this is foul stand and i will see you in the next video